we're going to demonstrate how to install your new Sassy Auto Frame. Um, first, we're going to demonstrate with the triple rows um, rhinestone on chrome frame. Um, we're using the anti theft fasteners with the special Allen wrench tool and some bling caps. Um, if you didn't buy the anti theft fasteners, you're just going to go ahead and use a Phillips or a flathead to use the screws that are already holding your plate on your vehicle currently. So, what you're going to first do is take your washer and do it like a concave shape. Put the screw through it so it like, fits like that around it. A lot of customers have questions with how to do that part alone. Then it goes frame, plate, this is the order it goes in. And we're only doing two on the top today because this vehicle only requires two on the top. Um, I get questions a lot with customers what to do with the bottom two. You can just glue these little cap covers on the bottom and um, cover up that hole if you'd like. And next I'll be showing the option as far as if we do have frames that only have two screws on the top for vehicles that only require two. So you're going to want to use your Allen wrench tool that was provided with your bling screw caps and get that started. Usually I just screw it in a little bit before I tighten it all the way, make sure they're both even. And this little tool, I would say when you're done, I just keep it in my glove box so that if I ever have to switch out my sassy frame to a different vehicle, it's easy to find. And the last step is you're going to want to pop your bling caps on top and it won't be secure unless you hear that snap. And it's secure and you're ready to go.